awesome sauce. Delaney, I'm gonna give this to you to edit. Make it beautiful. What's up, baby? Let me take you out to dinner. Anyway, um, what's up? Uh, I should have both hands on the wheel. I am trying to uh, start recording again. I tried the first time and then life happened. Life is wild. And then I stopped recording and now I'm recording again. Shut the Shut Oh, I need my seatbelt on. Haha. <laughs> What's wrong with all your seatbelts, kids? Hello, my name's Brandy. What's up? How are you doing? Yes, I am trying to start uh, recording again. Uh, I feel a lot more comfortable in front of the camera now. Before it was like, ah. Mm. Now I feel like uh, not only am I in the right headspace environment, and I just have the right type of friends to be able to do this. If I were to go ahead and record around my friends, I'd be like, oh, fuck yeah. You know? Um, didn't have that case before. Didn't feel comfortable enough. Now I do. So, doing this again. I'm heading over to Belton to go and get COVID tested because I called out of work sick for one day. Because I was actually sick. They're like, oh, you got COVID. I didn't think I'd be out of work for an entire week. So hopefully, this damn test comes back negative and then I can go back to work because I need I need I need this money Ew, no. I need the money because I'm broke I need to pay bills actually bills have already been paid I just need money for saving doing stuff that I want to do I never indulge in myself fun fact Brandy never indulges in herself why because um that's a long story. That's a long childhood story, you know? Long story short though, I'm just, I just don't tend to be the type of person to buy stuff for myself. I don't buy clothes. I don't buy jewelry, shit. I only have like two pairs of shoes, which are some bands that my fiance bought me and some boots that I got at Ross. That's it, nothing else. Aside from that, all of my clothes uh, uh, involve or include hand-me-downs and thrift store stuff that I'm like, oh, this is very universal. Like, I can wear this with anything. Don't have style. I do not. I don't, I don't know what else to say or talk about. I mean, I can talk about myself, but I talk about myself so often. That sounds so cocky. I talk about myself so often, and I'm tired of it. I recently dyed my hair pink. Um, I did it myself. Don't let anybody touch my hair. The one time that I got my hair bleached by somebody else, and I didn't like it because I wanted a balayage on my hair, and they just did an ombre instead with like a little bit of like streaks and stuff that were balayage, and I was just like, since it was freshly done, I was just like, yeah, it looks good actually it looks fine and then like two like a week later i was like this i ain't feeling this this ain't it i wasn't kicking with it and then i cut it i i had like a big chop you know but it wasn't for curly hair it was just it was just uh to get rid of most of the most of the blonde and my hair was down to like my my waist it was pretty long and then i just chopped that whole off whole thing off. Uh, I chopped it up to about like here-ish, give or take. And then like a month later, the hair grew out and I just cut it off again and boom, no more blonde. And I had it brunette for a while. And then um, I had it, it got longer. I didn't cut it. I only trimmed the ends and stuff. And that's when I just kind of got into the whole thing of me just taking care of my own hair nobody's touching my hair nobody's putting hands on it and also i just thought it was a lot more convenient i didn't have to spend any money 
I do my own hair, so I always have. And if it looks shitty, I don't get mad about it because I, I'm the one who's doing it, and I'm an I'm not a professional, so I'm not mad about it. And to begin with, I don't want it to look perfect. I just want it to look, you know, nice, you know, somewhat put together. I guess I don't know. I don't care. I don't care enough, but I care enough to not let somebody else touch my hair. Does that make sense? Probably not. Probably not. No. This is turned into my hair video. I can ramble on about literally anything. CADHDBB. What else is there to know about me? Oh, hobbies and things that I like. But, um, what do I like? I like reading. I do read. I am currently actually reading this. It is Legends and Liars by um, Julia Knight. It's actually really good and ironically enough when I pick it back up it doesn't like I don't forget what's happening like I'll just read it wherever I stopped and then I'll just remember I don't know it, it's just a good book I guess I'm really attentive to it it's probably just big brain stuff I don't know I like skating whether it's um roller skates you know ones that go separately on your feet quads I'm better at I've never touched blades. Blades are scary. But I also like skating, you know? Skateboarding. Skateboarding is fun. My fiance started to teach me how to do it again. It's pretty, pretty nice. I never learned how to do any tricks or anything. So I would either just longboard or just ride around with my friends and stuff. That's just about as far as I got. But um, eventually my fiance is going to teach me how to do more stuff. I also like crocheting. Crocheting is, is nice. I'll do it while I'm watching TV. That's pretty much it, you know. Reading, skating, crocheting. Uh, oh, I don't know where I need to go. Alrighty, just went inside. Uh, I, say I gotta go through the drive-thru to uh, get COVID tested. Right now, I have to drive through. I'm trying to think of what else. I mean, what is this channel going to include? Um, me doing dumbass shit. Me doing dumbass stuff. That's what it is. Because I am one dumb individual. I'm very clumsy. And I always constantly think because of everything that happens to me, I'm always like, I should have a camera at, on me at all times because good lord it's what i've always wanted to do like whenever i was younger i didn't have anybody well, of course i had people but you know i didn't think i had anybody i didn't feel like i had anybody the long story short i've just always wanted to become a content creator i've always wanted to become an influencer and i'd like to be the outlet i'd like to be someone's outlet that would that would genuinely make me so unbelievably happy you know i have friends that are artists and they make music and i'll listen to their music and i'm just like you like you guys are my outlet but i want to be someone's outlet you know i want to be able to help somebody that's always been the goal in life help people aside from all that cheesy jazz um I just doing it for fun i've always liked this i've tried doing this a couple times but i just never actually sit down and edit or push it further post it or anything but i feel like now i'm actually ready i've always just wanted to be ready for it and now i am oh, oh my god i'm just really hungry right now Ugh. i ha i don't have my m ms oh i have a brownie Mm, lovely. Have a swab of my nose. Ah. <laughs> oh, there's liquid in there. Solid. Oh. Ouch. Thank you for choosing CBS Pharmacy. Alrighty, don't 
done with that shit. <laughs> okay, now I go home and get food. What else do I say? Ah. Uh, um. Any questions, concerns, inquiries? Leave them down below. Comment about it. Um. Let me know what you want to see. Uh, any ideas, I guess. Because this is an us effort. You know? Um, I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I'm just going to keep going until I hit the highway. But yeah. That's me signing off. Good luck, Charlie. No, no. I'm going to get copyrighted. <laughs> Good luck, Brandy. Boom, there you go. Ta-da. Good luck, Brandy. Because honestly, I need it. <laughs> I forgot I haven't recorded it all today. So I'm wearing this sweater again because I really like this sweater. Anyways. I need to get out of this H-E-B parking lot. I just bought some stuff so I can make some waffles. And I got waffle mix. I got eggs i have bacon i have chocolate chips for the waffles and i got some tater tots because i don't know how to make hash browns i forgot how to make hash browns i need to learn how to make hash browns again so i just spend most of my morning having to deal with this fucking tire because i got a flat on my tire and then i forgot my card so they had to put a cheap ass tire on there Sentries don't ever get sentries. Them hoes are whack. Do not like them. They're not worth it. They're dirt cheap for for a good reason. And I had to go back home to go get my card. Uh, I they left the sentry on there because I wanted a road hugger because road huggers are better. Um. And then I had to go back, wait a little bit until they actually could service my car. And then I just. Got the tire put on, paid for it. It's like a hundred dollars. Now I'm on my way back home, so I can make these waffles for my fiance and roommates. Well, technically all of them are my roommates because my fiance lives with me. But nonetheless, I'm gonna make breakfast, and it's already about to be like 1 p.m. Whoop! I'm just so annoyed because I can't go to work because I haven't got my test results from the fucking covid test yet if i don't get them by tomorrow i'm gonna be so mad because i could be making bank right now not bank i could be making money instead of just doing nothing because all i'm gonna do is chores that's it just clean the house and make food <coughs> oh my god <coughs> I better know where I think I just <coughs> oh my god <coughs> I'll be right back I'm just dying real quick <coughs> oh my god is that a cop I don't fucking know do I even know do you if you don't know why would I know what if I don't know why would you know Cause clearly I ain't got enough brain cells. I'm like missing some. Anyways, I'm already home. So I... I'll see you guys inside. I'm sorry, that was so... I don't know why, <laughs> but that does kind of like me, a YouTuber, me talking to the camera. Blech.